Okay, so what I have done first of all is I have done a little sample of coffee, soy sauce, turmeric tea and the raspberries just so that I have got an idea of what my colours are going to be looking like. Now this is another option that you can do um, is using your ingredients, sort of making your own paints to do little fashion design sketches. So the best thing to do is to give yourself a template, so this is just actually going to be like drawing out your heads and then from that you're just going to do nice free flowing movements and play about with it and sort of just go with the flow so it's not a set plan that you know what you're designing you almost don't know how this garment is going to turn out you just kind of want to play about with it and see the nice loose lines and see what you can make from that so I'm just going to get started with my templates of the heads Next, Okay, so once you've got your head templates, this is when I'm good to go to start painting. So I'm starting off using the soya sauce, which is probably the darkest sort of dye. And I'm playing about with shape and volume and layers. I'm going to try a bit of the turmeric now. Back to the soy sauce here and just watch how it sort of goes into nice little puddles and I'm doing very 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 slight tiny sort of movements here okay just give my brush a wash and I'm going to try out the raspberries now try a different shape Sorry, I think my camera might have cut off there and I've now went on to my third um, person here. So what I've done for this one was I was just sort of playing about with nice little loose flicks with the brush to get a nice funky sort of dress with the texture. Moving on to this one here, I just sort of done again a loose sort of silhouette and see what I got with it. Quite strong pointed shoulders and trousers to go with it. And then it's up to yourself if you want to let some of your paint sort of dry in and then kind of go back over and add a bit more. It's completely up to yourself where you kind of go about this. Okay, and, and it's sort of playful and it's just your judgment of what you think might work. Okay, so that's some examples there. That was my first ones. And it might help if you sort of narrow it down if you know that you want to do men's wear or if it's women's wear that you're wanting to design for, that might just help narrow it down a little bit. Okay, 